what's up guys welcome back once again it is me molt so happy to be here with you guys today we are on our clash without walls account guys doing some more pushing without walls we have just been attacked um and i really have to review these attacks and try and find ways to help protect my base a little bit more um we did get a victory uh in defense and got 19 trophies for it so when we do lose guys it's generally only one stars which is good you can see that for practically all of these um, except for this bottom one it was a two star but he only got nine trophies for the most part it's one star which isn't bad for an account without wall so i'm definitely happy with getting those one stars um as defenses because then i get a shield as well and i can get loot to upgrade stuff and so on and so forth but um why don't we go ahead well actually let's let's um let's attack first so i'm gonna go find a base for us to attack i've got some giants um, and some wall breakers and whatnot trained up. This is perfect because we're going to get so much loot for it as well. We are definitely going to attack this uh, base. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, and then let's start spreading out around the base as well. Get some goblins out here to help out, um, and then we'll drop off these five on this side. Get them up in there. This loot is definitely going to help out. This is. I would have attacked this base even if I was a farming. It had even if I was farming. So it has 19 trophies, which is perfect. Um, and let's go ahead and drop off down here as well. Some of these barbarians are working their way around. We'll drop off the rest of our goblins, which are going to help take out all the resources. And guys, goblins aren't. The, there are a couple good things about goblins. So um, a, the fact that they go for resources if you're looking for loot, but also because they do more damage to those buildings. So that means you have. It's going to get rid of more buildings so that your barbarians and your archers can focus on other stuff. Um, so it's, they're not just there for loot. They're there to help take out percentages and whatnot. So here we go. We're actually going to end up getting a three-star on this guy. So awesome loot. 19 trophies. Didn't even have to search or anything like that. Um, there it goes. Let's see. Where is the... So they got to go to all these builder sets in the corner. Let's see which corner wins. <laughs> the bottom corner is going to win for sure and there goes the top one right there guys 100% awesome 19 trophies for that uh, 263,000 gold 166,000 loot that is ridiculous that's really really good so I'm definitely happy with that and then let's go ahead and do um, two giants in each one so we'll roll with eight and then uh, one wall breaker in each one as well and then now we're just gonna do uh, let's do Let's do 20 goblins. Again, guys, it's it's good to keep everything the same uh, in your barracks just because it makes it train up faster. We'll do 20 barbarians in each one. Um, <clears throat> uh, let's do 20. Yeah, we'll do 20 in each one. And then the rest will just be archers. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and show you all some of those replays. And we're going to kind of try and analyze it and see how well we did. Um... I don't know, just to figure out what we can do better from a defense standpoint, so on and so forth. But we also need to upgrade some bombs with our deep, with our uh, with our gold and whatnot. So I really want to upgrade these giant bombs. Um, do we not have any? Do we not have any air bombs? We have them. I just where are they on my thing? Oh, okay, so they're up towards the top. Um, but first, let's go ahead and watch this defense play. Let's watch this first one that we lost and see how we do. Um, <clears throat> so it looks like my air bombs might have, No, my air bombs probably weren't deployed at this point. But my uh, other traps were, so I wasn't on for this one. Now, if I had had my uh, spring traps and my bombs there... Well, there's one bomb right there that's doing a little bit of damage to those giants, but not much. Um, there's that giant bomb, and they... De that was kind of dumb. They made it go off, even though they weren't really in uh, the vicinity of it. So um, maybe I need to figure out a way to put that uh, somewhere better. Now he's dropping off. He's using giant healer. He's doing a good job, um, but he doesn't really have. He has six wizards, forty-five archers that he has to use. He only gets a one star, which is surprising because there's practically no defenses left up here at the top. Uh, so I don't really know what his wizards and dragons are going to do. Almost all of his giants are down now. Um, they're getting focused by the Teslas, the wizard towers, the cannons, the archers, all that kind of stuff. So all of his giants are down now. We do have some defenses that can help with air troops. So I'm definitely interested to see what happens when it comes to uh, the dragon. Let's go ahead and fast forward just a little bit here and see what happens. Um, I don't know why it's, there it goes, it was lagging a little bit, but it just stopped. So there goes wizards at the bottom, 
Um, he still has his dragon up. He's about to get all of that gold right there. There goes the dragon, um, and there goes all of my gold. So I'm losing a lot of gold, but again, that is fine because we are looking for uh, trophies right now. They are working on the town hall, as you can see. I wonder if they're in range of that Tesla or if they just run out of time. I imagine they're just going to run out of time. Um, that dragon is doing work. If that dragon had turned and focused on the town hall, then it probably would have been GG for us. So all he does is run out of time, which is actually good uh, for us that he didn't have enough time to finish uh, destroying the base. We were saved Elixir, which is good because when we're trophy pushing, um, we're going to be attacking a lot, obviously, so we need Elixir to train up our troops. Um, let's go ahead and watch this defense one where we win. He uses two hogs of Valkyrie. It's kind of a random attack strategy for sure. Um, the hogs have nothing to jump over, so they're probably a little bit confused. There go the hogs in on that cannon. Um, he's not deploying that heavily. I, if I were him, I would spread them out more and deploy a lot quicker um, because they're just not getting in there fast enough. You need to overwhelm a base. Um, you need to overwhelm the defenses. Uh, the only time it's dangerous to do that is when there's a lot of splash damage. Um, it looks like his wall break or his uh, hog riders were only able to take out that cannon, which is hilarious. Um, so there he goes, heading right into the middle. There go some spring traps. Some of our giant bombs have gone off. Um, the wizard towers are doing work right now, thankfully, because all of those barbarians are heading right in on the town hall, which we do not want. Um, there are those archers as well, and we are about to get all of those. There goes the last mortar shot on them. Only eight seconds left, so the guy goes ahead and uh, has deployed everything, and he's not going to get the uh, the percentage that he needed. If he had dropped off some stuff around the edges, then he might have done a little bit better, but thankfully he did not do that because we were able to keep some trophies. So we're at 1258 right now. We are in silver one. Um, guys, let me know if y'all want me to just kind of push when I'm not here and whatnot. Um, I do, I'll do random attacks. Like here's an attack. Well, we just did this one. <laughs> I did an attack right before this, um, as well. Uh, they got me 23 trophies and that was only for a two star. Um, and this base is actually pretty good for a town hall seven. Um, I took out that mortar right there because the one next to it was upgrading. And then we just attacked from the top because there's a good amount of gold here. Like I said, I really need to upgrade my uh, traps, my mines, my bombs, all that kind of stuff. So we get in here. We take out the town hall. Even though that mortar is doing some work, we take it out right there. And then we just work our way around the rest of the base. Um, I knew that we weren't going to be able to get the three star. So we can go ahead and back out there. But we did get a good amount of trophies for that. So uh, it's pretty easy pushing right now. I did get another Christmas tree up here, guys. Both of them are in the same same corner. Um, this one hasn't spawned another present. That's kind of annoying. Um, so we're doing pretty good there when it comes to uh, defense. I'm actually, I'm okay with only losing one star because then we'll get more when we attack and slowly continue pushing. Uh, but let's go ahead and see what we can upgrade. So these are 750,000 for the giant bombs. The little bombs are a little bit less. Um, they do 20 damage. The giant bombs do 200 damage. <laughs> wow, that's pretty, that's a lot. Um, why don't we do this? Why don't we, we're gonna, we're gonna do a little bit of reorganization. We're gonna scoot this mortar right over here. We're gonna bring this spring trap down and we're gonna put this giant bomb right in there. And then we are going to upgrade it. Oh no, I can't upgrade at this level. Crap, so those are only allowed to be level two. Oh no, I didn't realize that. <laughs> That's pretty annoying. Um, we'll go ahead and upgrade, I guess, these little bombs then. Uh, upgrade right there. Upgrade right here. I had no idea that that was the case. Can we upgrade these to level four at least? Yes, we can. All right, so we're going to get all of our mini mines up uh, and get those rolling. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and scoot this over, bring this down, and bring this giant bomb right in here. That way, uh, the middle is protected a little bit better. And then I think that's going to be it, guys. I hope that you all are liking this series. Um, I'm probably going to do a lot of attacks in the future and um, when I'm not on and just show you all some of the better ones so that we can start pushing and getting up. Uh, but, yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. really do appreciate it. And as always, make sure you keep calm and you clash on them, right? See you guys later. Peace.